happy up. I think it's gonna hurt. Sweaty. I'm into it. Pam, I get it. Hi, I'm Morgan, I'm Women's Health's digital fitness writer, and this week I am trying three of YouTube heavyweight Pamela Reeves workouts. Pamela has over 4.86 million followers on YouTube. That's like a small city. And some of her workouts have over 35 million views each. I'm really excited. I've never tried a Pamela workout before. The only catch is that she's not a certified PT. So I've enlisted the help of third space master trainer, Lucy Cohen, who can give us her expert insight on what she thinks of the workouts, if they're safe, and also what the programming could have benefited from. Let's do it. Good morning. It is a beautiful sunny morning and I slept through my alarm. I love to work out in the morning. It makes me feel so good before the day starts. Today we don't have time for a lengthy sweat. So I'm gonna do Pamela's 10 minute six pack core workout. Oh, okay. She's not saying anything. Right, we're just gonna get straight into it. Leg lift circles. She's not saying much. By not much, nothing. Because it's quite heavy music. It feels like I'm in a weird club. Okay. Her neck is up. Should my neck be up? Cross spider plank. Oh my god, I've never heard of this. No, that's wrong. Oh. So that is the workout done. It was a fairly abrupt end. She didn't really give any indication the workout was finishing or about to finish. It just ended. I think it was good. It was challenging. I got a bit sweatier, as you can see, than I thought I would get. I think if you're a beginner, it'd be very difficult because she doesn't give any form tips and actually didn't say a single word for the entire workout. I think you have to be a fairly seasoned exerciser and know the correct technique. I liked it. Did I love it? No. Hey, I'm Lucy Cowan. The exercise selection in this core workout are actually pretty good. They're pretty good exercises if you're able to do them properly. So that means you're able to keep your lower back down into the floor and you're able to maintain contact with your spine and the floor. I think the exercises that she picked in the order at which she put them is actually really advanced and will be a challenge for most people to do well. I've just finished work for the day and I'm gonna do Pamela's 10 minute lower body strength workout. I wouldn't normally choose a strength workout that was so short in length, only because your lower body has these ginormous muscles that can take so much strain that 10 minutes doesn't seem like a long enough time to fatigue them properly. I'm intrigued, it will be an experiment and I really wanted a short workout today because it's the first day of my period, I'm knackered. I just wanna do a quick workout, have some food and go to bed. Having a very quick pre-workout snack of coffee cake and icing, great, let's get on with it. Pulse lunge left. So it seems to be the same as her other workouts. It's 30 seconds non-stop, just rolls into the next exercise. So far, these are all movements I would do in my normal workouts. I'd probably have an activation before, but we live. I think I might have been wrong. I think it's gonna hurt. Abductor squat. So down and then pulse out. Oh. Go down to the mat. On my front, on my back. This is an exercise that I would normally do before a workout to activate my glutes. But I guess because it's only 10 minutes, it's a weird mix of activation and exercise. She does play good music. It gets you through. Whew. Oh, the workout's over. <laughs> okay, so that 
that is the workout done. I'm a little bit sweatier than I expected. I'm much redder. It was a good workout. It was challenging. It was interesting not to have a warm up. I um, have it drilled into me that you should always do a warm up before lower body. But there were activation exercises in there. There are exercises that specifically targeted your glutes and there were some warm ups with the lunges and the leg raises. I really liked it. I think it was a really good workout if you're comfortable with form. I think again, if you're a beginner, it would be very difficult. I mean, I've never heard of frog kicks. But the rest of it, good, challenging, quick, 10 minutes, done and dusted. Cheers, Pam. Nice one. A nice, simple workout that's easy to follow, that doesn't overcomplicate things, and that targets all muscles in our lower body. To go straight in in our first exercise with a pulsing lunge, quite a risky thing to do. Um, when people kind of haven't had a chance to warm up, they haven't had a chance to feel both legs working together and then to progress to a trickier exercise. There are a lot of squats variations, one after another after another. So it'd be great to either have some recovery added in here or to just mix up the exercises a little bit to give our back and our core and certain muscles in our legs a recovery in between these exercises. Welcome to the last day of the PAM experiment. I have a 20 minute full body workout set up on my laptop. It's got 35 million views, so I'm not the only one who suffered through it. Only 20 minutes. I think it's gonna be sweaty. It's gonna set me up for the day. I'm into it. Let's do it. Again, straight in, no explanations. Squat jumps. Squat jumps. <laughs> my name is gonna kill me. I don't know how apartment friendly all this jumping is. Oh, we get a minute break. I think this first round is designed to get you sweaty and warm. I think it's kind of like a pseudo warm up. Oh, it says well done on the screen, that's lovely. Lay down, push up. Okay. She's mixing up strength moves with cardio moves. I guess that full body effect. Ooh. Okay, we get another break. I think I've got much more comfortable with her not speaking. I found it really off-putting at the beginning to for her not to be saying anything, but now. First thing in the morning, it's actually nice to just listen to music and follow along. I'm into it. Pam, I get it, I get it. Oh, <laughs> and the workout is over again. <laughs> all in all, a good workout. It was a mix of cardio, strength, core work, using your big muscles in your back and also in your thighs and your glutes. I liked it a lot. Sweaty. So it would be great to see some options for easier exercises here. 20 minutes is a really long time and to carry on all the way through whilst actually maintaining your proper form. I think a lot of everyday exercises may well struggle to do this. Overall, none of Pamela's workouts have any mobility or activation or any real warm up. Going straight into these exercises, going straight into these workouts, my opinion is the body wouldn't be quite ready for it. Five minutes to maximum 10 minutes of mobility, of activation, just to get the body ready for the impact and to get the body ready to work hard would really, really benefit everybody. So that is the week done with Pamela. I feel good. I don't feel sore in the slightest, which is fantastic. I loved how short the workouts were. Sometimes when you work out and you're trying to work from home, it can feel just like this upwards mountain you have to summit. And it just feels like too much. But because these were so short and so easy to follow and you could kind of zone out to the music, I totally get why so many people love them. The number one thing I would say is that it's 
frustrating she's not a personal trainer. A certified personal trainer, they know what they want you to do and why they want you to do it and there's so much thought behind it that comes from training and qualification and certification. So from that respect, I think it was fantastic to have Lucy giving a few of her thoughts and letting us know what she thought of the workout. As a lay person though, like myself, thoroughly enjoyable. At the beginning, it was weird that she wasn't talking, but then by the end of it, I just got it. I don't think it was that accessible to beginners. There's no form tips and no coaching throughout the whole thing. But if you're used to exercising and you want a bit of inspiration or a way to spice up the end of a workout, I think it's a, I think it's a massive winner. Whole week done of Pamela Reeves workouts. Kind of love them. <laughs>